piece of cake, you said. Slam dunk, you said. Who walked in the park? Hey, how was I supposed to know that lab had a silent alarm? Oh, man, why do I listen to you? We made the heist, didn't we? And we're gonna get paid top dollar for this sweet little piece of biotech. Whatever it is. Uh-oh. Hey, hey, I can't shake him! Over there! Uh... Booyah! Pull in there. Nice. But the city's still swarming with cops looking for us and the stash. <laughs> what do we do now? We just walk away. Are you nuts? We let the heat die down, then come back tomorrow, and we're home free. Uh, uh, hey! Uh, wait for me! Piece of junk. Yep, there, there. Come on, this is the place. It's supposed to have the best deals in town. I don't know, Curb. Looks kind of sketchy. Huh? Dude, it's fine. Trust me, we're gonna pick you out a real winner for your first car. I want that case by tomorrow, or you'll get another taste of. Your old friend! Let's go, Turbo! I'm Max McGrath. Here's my buddy Steel. Yeah, he's an alien. I generate the power, Steel has the alien tech to control it. Together, we combine into awesome turbo modes. Take on the bad guys, save the world. You know, hero stuff. We are Max Steel. Did we really have to bring Kirby along? It's my first car, Steel. I need all the help I can get. Besides, Kirby took auto shop last semester. <laughs> Although I'm not sure he passed. I'm okay. Plus, homecoming is coming up. I really want to ask Sydney and be able to pick her up myself like it was a real date. This is important, Steel. Excuse me, fellas. Did this quality pre-owned vehicle catch your eye? More like get caught me. Well, you're in luck. Today's our big one-day barn burner sales event. <laughs> We're just browsing. My driver's exam is in a couple of days. Son, you don't need a license to own a car. If you've got your permit and a licensed driver with you, you can drive off the lot today. Hmm. Uh, I'm a licensed driver. Yet another reason to always buckle up. Perfect! <laughs> okay, we grab the car and everything's cool. Hmm? Uh. Take this butte, for instance. Yeah, they don't make them like this anymore. Probably a good thing. Hmm. Maybe you like something a little sportier, huh? I can let you have this baby for only six grand. I've only got 600. Yeah, kid, you're killing me. Huh? Hey, would you hurry up already? Mm. Mm. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm coming. Well, how about this one? Yeah, it's, uh, uh, it's uh, <clears throat> not in my inventory. <laughs> Must be a computer glitch. Hmm. Here we are. <laughs> Come on. Make me an offer. I, I don't know. Just imagine yourself cruising down the road, your special lady sitting by your side, huh? The whole world on your horizon. Where shall we go, Max? Wherever the road takes us, my darling. Ugh, this really stinks. 
<laughs> I'll take it. I like you, kid. Well, let's do the deal for 600. So, what's her name? Sydney. Sydney Gardner. <laughs> Suckers. Mm. Ah, the car. It's gone. Hey, hey, get back here! Oh, this ain't a parking lot, you knucklehead. It's a used car lot. Don't sweat it. We'll get it back. Oh, yeah, we'll get it back. How are we gonna do that? However we gotta. Hey, boys! Hey, have you heard about our one-day barn burner? Say, say... Oh. <laughs> Uh, Max, why are you driving with the floor mats? Oh, uh, I just, uh, I just like the feel. Guess we didn't really think through your whole turbo touch problem, did we? Yeah, tell me about it. About what? Oh, uh, about what a great driver I am. <laughs> uh oh. Ah! Who was that? That was my car frying. Use the handbrake, Max! The handbrake? The handbrake! <sighs> Maybe we should have taken a test drive. You know, this could take a while, Kirby. You ought to just head home. Sorry, Max. Good luck. Thanks. My turbo energy is gonna fry the electric system of any car I touch. Then perhaps instead of calling for a tow, we should call someone else. Upgrade your ride? My pleasure. The only question is, where do I start? Hmm. This the place? Yeah, that's what the car guy said. Apartment 414. Well, we're not exactly inconspicuous sitting in this thing. It was a fair trade. We get the car, he gets to keep his kneecaps. Now we just wait for this McGrath kid to show. Must be the kid's mom. Could be trouble. Go take care of her. Hey, you beat it, lady, and no one gets hurt. Uh, beg your pardon? Go get a cup of coffee or something. I have a better idea. Back off, lady! The real estate lady told me this was a nice neighborhood. You wouldn't want to make her a liar now, would you? Uh-oh. Crime doesn't pay, boys. It hurts! Ow! Let's get out of here! <laughs> Man, she's almost as bad as that tiger Mr. Winter sicked on us. Don't remind me. I told you. The name is Extroyer now! <laughs> you have not delivered to me what you are ordered to fetch! We had it! I swear! But, but then some kid took it! I don't want excuses. I want what is mine. What will soon make me the true king of the beasts! <laughs> now, do what you must. But get me that case. Hey, Mom, we're home. Hi, honey. Whoa. Tough day at the office? Nothing I couldn't handle. How was your day? Pretty good. I, uh, bought a car. What? I think I'll just leave you two alone. <laughs> Coward. Listen, Mom, you're always telling me I should be responsible. What could be more responsible than saving my money and buying my own set of wheels? Not doing it behind my back. I was gonna tell you, but then it just kind of happened. I got a really good deal. Well, you are taking your driver's test tomorrow. Just promise me it's safe. Safe? It's totally safe. 
In fact, Berto's doing a tune-up as we speak. Why does that not comfort me? Like you asked, I overhauled everything so your turbo energy wouldn't short things out anymore. Just in time for my driver's test. But then I thought, why stop there? You've got a turbo cycle. Ooh. I figure, why not a turbo car? So I installed a turbo interface. Turbo, turbo interface. interface? Go on, Steel, try it out. It's complete with a heads-up digital display, and a hidden flip-out armory, and and a stealth mode that renders this baby nearly invisible. And what's this do? <laughs> oh man! Oops. Yeah, don't do that during your driver's exam. The car lot guy said Max had the hots for some chick named Sydney. Here we are. See you tomorrow, guys. Bingo. Sydney Gardner? Uh, yeah? I don't get it. I've texted, I've called, but Sydney's not answering. How about you concentrate on your driver's test first and your big date second? Yeah. Hi, Mr. Jones. I'll be administering your driving test today. Remember, young man, driving is a privilege, not a right. Now then, Mr. McGrath. Uh, M McGroof, uh, pull out and turn right. <laughs> yes, sir. I can't talk right now. I'm in the middle of my driving. Max, I've been kidnapped. These guys say you have something that belongs to them, and unless you give it back, they're gonna... Sid? Hello? Sid, hello! Uh, what was that? Uh, who's taking a nap? Uh, oh, what's going on? Oh, oh. <laughs> my glasses. Ah, uh, dear me. Oh, I can't see a nickel without them. We'll find her, Max. Let's do this. <laughs> Find who from what now? I've walked on the Sydney cell signal. She's headed south on Thompson Street. Hang on, Mr. Jones. I'd say that's got your boyfriend's attention. <laughs> what? Is that Max Steel? Whoever it is, lose him. Time to see what this buggy can do. <laughs> Remember to mind the speed limit and obey all right. Mr. Jones, you okay? Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. <laughs> They're toast! What? No! Max, let's try to avoid the six o'clock news. Remember what Force did the last time we made the headlines? Yeah, don't remind me. Let's go stealth! Finally! We're in the clear. Now where are they headed? Hopefully away from your adoring public. <sighs> Time to give your boyfriend our demands. Call him back. Hi, I'd like to order a large anchovy pizza with... Why, you little... <laughs> I don't even like anchovies. <laughs> <laughs> And where does this Max kid find these games? Uh, Max? <laughs> yeah. Go Turbo! Let the girl go, and no one gets hurt. I am 
Extroyer! Extroyer? I didn't think he survived his little plunge into the Pacific. No! You've interfered for the last time, Max Steel. Where did your boyfriend hide the car? His car? What are you talking about? There's something in it that belongs to me. As I was saying, let the girl go. Not till I get what I want. Whoa. And what he wants is apparently in your car, Max. Uh, I have it. I took it from the kid earlier. Show me. Uh, Max, we don't even know what it is. I hope you know what you're doing. Yeah, me too. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Uh... Hmm. Uh. Oh. Here we go. Max, wait. Considering the lengths Extroyer's gone to get this case, is it really wise to give it to him? He's got Sydney. We don't have a choice. What is it? Living DNA samples extracted from the world's rarest and deadliest creatures. Huh? We went through all this for some stinking science project? Fools! With these, I can transform into the most dangerous animals on Earth. With these, I'll answer to no one. Not Miles Dredd, not Matt Steele. Allow me to demonstrate with this Black Cobra. Yeah, we shouldn't have given him that case. Let's not dwell on the past. In fact, let's not dwell at all. <laughs> by getting out of here. Wait, I don't even have my license. No problem. <laughs> I've tweaked the GPS to take you to the nearest police station. Wow, thanks. You're very welcome, miss. I really appreciate you guys saving me from that weird tiger monster. <sighs> miss, it's our duty and our pleasure. <gasps> now off with you. Let's get you to safety. <laughs> Where were we? Steel? Ah, uh, yes. Go Turbo! Strength! Yeah! Go Turbo! Flight! <laughs> Missed us! Did I? I stand corrected. You're not standing at all. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> 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 Now then, how shall I finish you off? Polar bear? Steel, take the wheel. Right! Harpy eagle! Perhaps a saber-toothed tiger. You're rope kill destroyer! <laughs> Ugh, I think we destroyed Extroyer. Then let's head back before Father Time wakes up. I say we rolled two. Yeah, and I say we stopped working for this psycho. <laughs> I don't think that's going to be an issue anymore.
Uh, Mr. Jones? Uh, who was it? Oh, sorry. Must have dozed off there. Guess we should probably schedule a retake, huh? Retake? Oh, nonsense. We got back in one piece, didn't we? Congratulations, Mr. McCrud. You've passed. Wow, a snake monster. Huh. Well, I'm just happy you're okay. Yeah, yeah, I want to hear all about it at school tomorrow. Okay. That's it? What about the homecoming dance? He didn't even ask her. Wasn't that the point of all this? You know, Steel, part of having your license is making responsible decisions, and well, I've decided Sid's been through enough today. You really have earned your license. So, since Sidney's not going to be riding shotgun just yet, what do you say you and I go cruising? I say, let's roll. So, Max, where are we headed? Wherever the road takes us, Steel. Wherever the road takes us. Vegas, baby! 